fast connectors. AFL's fast connectors are pre-polished field installable connectors that eliminate the need for hand polishing in the field. Precision mechanical alignment ensures low loss with a proprietary gel. Fast connectors provide an immediate termination to both single mode or multi-mode fibers and are color coded for ease of fiber identification. This video will guide the user through the steps required to properly terminate the fast LC connectors. The fast connector toolkit contains the following items. The CT30A universal cleaver, a three millimeter cable clamp, a two millimeter cable clamp, a strip template, an instructional CD-ROM, a fiber stripper, Kevlar scissors, lint-free cloth wipes, fiber prep fluid, a marker pen, and a carrying case. The Fast LC Connector Components Fast LC Connector Assembly A 250 micron protective tube A clear protective tube a 3 mm boot, a 2 mm boot, and a 900 micron boot. Warning: Always wear eye protection when handling optical fibers. Dispose of any cut or cleaved ends properly. 2 or 3 mm cable termination. The components and tools required for installation are fast LC connector assembly, a 2 mm boot, a 3 mm boot, a 2 mm cable clamp, a 3 mm cable clamp, a fiber stripper, Kevlar scissors, a CT30A cleaver, fiber prep fluid, lint-free cloth wipes, a marker pen, and a strip template. Place the cable into the 2 or 3 mm clamp 12 inches away from the end of the cable and slide the white U-piece to clamp the cable. Slide the 2 mm boot onto the cable. Refer to the strip template and mark the 2 or 3 mm cable at 65 mm from the end of the cable. Remove 65 mm of 2 or 3 mm cable jacket. Refer to the strip template and mark the 900 micron fiber at 35 mm from the end of the fiber. Strip 35 mm of 900 micron coating from the fiber. Clean the bare fiber using a lint-free wipe moistened with fiber preparation fluid or 95% or better isopropyl alcohol. Flick the fiber to verify integrity. Insert the bare fiber into the precision fiber cleaver and cleave to a minimum length of 10 millimeters, 11 millimeters maximum. Verify the wedge is fully engaged into the connector by pressing the top and bottom of the wedge. Insert the fiber slowly into the rear of the connector until connection is made. Make a slight bow after the connection is made to maintain connection. Squeeze the wedge unit to release the wedge. Split the Kevlar equally to each side of the Kevlar grip. Slide the boot up and screw the boot onto the connector. Use the Kevlar scissors to trim the excess Kevlar. Unclamp and pull the cable out of the cable clamp. Termination complete.